top of the fact that Angie in this shirt just looks amazing on smoke. <laughs> okay? So we were just talking about what was good that was going on. And what's good that's going on is that he's over tracking. So that means he's using and lifting his back and he's stretching and he's working from the back to front over his top line, okay? So what Angie's trying to do, so since um, Smoke has a little bit of a tendency to curl, right? You're asking him to flex and stretch. So what I, what I wanted to say is there's two ways to stretch the horse. One is to keep the horse down and round with the nose tucked in, and the other one is to, is to allow the horse to go down and out. Okay, so Smoke needs to go down and out. So that means with the nose out a little bit because he has a tendency to curl, all right? Now a horse that wants to be above the bit and is hollow and rigid and stiff, we're gonna keep them down and round. Any questions? What's that? When he goes into the trot, that's where he tends to go. Go where? Up oh, okay, well, yeah. So this is the walk, which is one of the hardest gates to ride because you have to follow the longitudinal motion with your elbows, which is that forward and back motion. The trot should be easier <laughs> because there is no longitudinal motion, but the, the trot's the foundation gate. It's just always harder for people to ride the trot because there's a whole lot going on. So another thing that we didn't mention is how nice and straight and balanced he is, okay? So you definitely have him on your aids. Straight means with his head in the middle of his shoulders. So he's working equally on all four legs.